Hello everybody, this is Mika. This is Paul. Welcome to Swahili Nation Podcast. Naam, naam. Hii ni yona. Je, unadhani kwamba na nitaanza na wewe Fajo. Unadhani kwamba hii mambo nayoona, unadhani kwamba sisi wa Africa, je, tupo independent? Kwa sababu independent na sawa ule uhuru ambao tulishaopata toka miaka 60 iliyopita kutoka kwa wakoloni. Tukapata independence yetu tukaanza kuishi peke yetu mpaka sasa baada ya miaka 60 baadaye lakini mpaka sasa hivi kuna maamuzi ambayo sisi hatuwezi tukayafanya bila hao hayo mataifa makubwa kuja na ku, na kuzuia au kutu au ku, ku put sanctions on us na kila kitu sasa swali nakuja kwamba je unadhani are we independent je yeah, ule uhuru ambao unasema tuliopata ambao uh, babu yetu Nyerere na Karume walitupa je yeah. tupo huru Tanzania specifically hata Africa pia. Je, unadhania tupo huru na kwa nini hatupo huru? Mm. Na sasa hivi ni miaka 60 baadaye. Yeah. Yaani ni kama vile ni kama vile wewe ni mtoto mm. una miaka 60 lakini bado unaishi na baba yako, baba yako anakuambia muda gani wa kula, muda gani wa kulala, muda gani wa kufanya nini hauna maamuzi yako mwenyewe mm. kwa kiwango fulani nasema. So, je, huo ni uhuru ambao tunahitaji wa Africa? Okay. Uh, laba ni jibu kwa kwanza kusema kwamba mm kuna kuwa huru na kuna kuishi uhuru. Mm-hmm. Kuwa huru ni jambo la kwanza. Mm-hmm. Kuishi kama mtu ambaye yuko huru ni jambo la pili. And that uh, inakuja like that comes down from mm-hmm. mentality. Mhm. Nitoe mfano mmoja alisikia kwa Joel na Nauka mm-hmm. alikuwa na anazungumzia kwa the whole idea of uh, decisions. Mm-hmm. Kwamba kuna tembo mmoja alikuwa amefungwa mahali. Mhm. Sawa? Mm-hmm. Amefungwa na kamba mfungua sasa uh, roots zake zikawa just near kwa sababu kama haimruhusu kwenda mbali mm. after some time mm. akawa amefunguliwa ile tembo mm. now the weird part is yule tembo hakuweza kwenda mbali na pale alipokuwa azunguka regardless kama alikuwa yuko huru my right kwa hapo mentality yake ilikuwa haipo exactly uhuru, uhuru alikuwa nao oh, okay right mm. but hakuweza kufanya ah, zaidi kwa sababu I love that. <laughs> kwa sababu mentality yake ilitari iko pale bado wow. ana, bado ana fikra za wow. ki, za kuwa captive come on come on <laughs> you understand well, don't feel jealous man okay <laughs> the nation as a, a nation Tanzania we mm-hmm. are independent yeah. we really are mm-hmm. like it comes down to people themselves the people of the nation of Tanzania are mm-hmm. they free are they independent cuz kama tunakuwa huru kitanzania lakini mentality yetu bado yuko ki kuwa dependent we're still looking up to wa china wa mm. korea wa mm. uh, marekani and stuff mm. to help mm. us to give mm. us the answers you mm. know to yeah. create all kinds of systems ndio yeah. maana rais wa afrika au china kuleta kitu kwa watanzania mm. na kukibwaga mm. na kuwa rais sana kupokelewa kwa sababu mm. at some point mm. our minds now mm. are still mm. dependent and we feel kwamba maamuzi wow. yetu kama wa Tanzania au uh, tunayoyawaza kwa ajili yetu sisi mm. wa Tanzania mm. they are not that high mm. au hayana manufaa sana yeah. kama watu wengine wa nje mm. kumbe and mm. i believe most of the times we might be very right actually extremely <laughs> right of course lakini uh, kutokana na dependency mindset ambayo tunayo mm. tunakuta we leave our decisions and our ideas mm. pembeni na kuchukua vitu vingi yeah Yeah. So ni hata tu hivyo kwa mbali kuna tofauti ya kuwa huru oh my <laughs> god you just, you just drop Hiroshima <laughs> here that's <to us> right <laughs> now <laughs> Naona nisemwe hivi kwamba yani ulichosema ni kitu kikubwa sana ambacho wefa Julu haujajua unajua unajua mission yetu mission ya Swahili Nation One Africa mm-hmm. nasema Snowa ni um, to defend the image of Africa mm-hmm. and to bring back all the heritage mm-hmm. that were taken a long time ago mm-hmm. by the colonizers and then to decolonize the mind to decolonize authentic. the mind through authentic mm-hmm. knowledge mm-hmm. and to create a bridge for oneness and a peaceful Africa. Kwa Kiswahili nasema ni kulinda ile image ile picha ya Africa na kurudisha zile zile mali au zile zile heritage na zamani kwa Kiswahili vile vitu vile ule utajiri uh-huh. ambao ulichukuliwa zamani na wakoloni walivyokuja uh-huh. lakini pia to decolonize the mind yani ku 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 ku, ku, ku kukomboa, uh-huh. ubongo wetu uh-huh. au ufahamu wetu uh-huh. kutoka katika ufahamu ule wa kikoloni kukomboa yeah. uje yeah. kwenye ufahamu wetu wa sasa yeah. 
through authentic knowledge kupitia elimu sahihi mm-hmm. kwa hiyo kwa, kwa uh, in the perspective ya Africa yani kupitia elimu sahihi ya Africa yes. ambayo unafahamu sisi yes. yani historia zetu na culture zetu na kila kitu chetu yes. lakini pia kutengeneza bridge kutengeneza daraja ya amani mpendo na mshikamano wa Afrika. Mm. Hiyo ndio mission. Sasa wewe ulichozungumza kina link kwenye part ya decolonization of the mind. Mm. Na hiyo ni ni nani ni, ni, ni agenda kubwa sana na hizo mzee hapa yeah, Snowa. Yeah. yeah, tunasema reimagining Africa. Mm. Kwa hiyo umesema kitu kimoja kikubwa sana. Kwamba oh my goodness. Yaani I don't even want to repeat it kwa sababu stuck in toilet gems uliyotoa. Lakini naungana na wewe mkono wa asilimia moja Kwamba swali langu likwaje? Yeye ni arime sawa swali. Swali langu ni uwezaje? Kama tunao ule au really independent. Exactly. Na kweli ukasema kwa <laughs> oh my god this is just too good. This is too good. <laughs> Alright, hii ni nzuri sana. Kwa hiyo ule kwamba tuna uhuru ndiyo upo lakini mind zetu hazijakombolewa, hatupo uhuru. Ndio maana kuna vitu vingi ndio maana tunashabikia sana vitu vya nje. Mm, mm. Yeah. tunashabikia western culture uh-huh. jinsi wanavyovaa yeah. nguo zao swag mm-hmm. zao mm-hmm. na tuna abandon our culture, our culture. and our swags mm-hmm. na pia tunashindwa hata kusambua kwa mfano sasa hivi kwa Marekani kuna watu wale wanachola matatu usoni mm-hmm. na kila kitu tunashindwa kutambua kwamba ile ni african culture mm-hmm. wa makonde huko walikuwa wanafanya hizo zamani sana yeah. kabla hata yani hao wakoloni wajaye huko wanafanya yeah. hivyo ni vitu vyetu vilikuwa mm-hmm. kuna zile suruali za mabwalo zile kama zile za jeje zile mm-hmm. <laughs> zile ni vitu ambavyo vilikuwa huko watu zamani sana yeah. Si maafro sijui ni nayo yote alikuwa hapo. Lakini sasa unaota kwamba ile mind kwa sababu haijakombolewa. Kwa hiyo tunashabikia sana vitu vya kwao na inafika hadi hatua tuna question our own traditions. Tuna question utamaduni wetu kwamba je, hivi hii ni sahihi? Mm. Yaani leo hapa kwa mfano kweli na this is really sad. Kwamba leo kama rais wetu Mheshimiwa Mama Samia akisimama na akiongea Alafu labda rais sio wa Marekani akisimama na kiongeo. Wapo watu ambao watamsikiliza rais wa Marekani lakini hata msikiliza rais wao wenyewe. Kwa hiyo tumekuwa ni watu ambao tunafuatilia sana vitu vya kwa na tunasahau vitu vyetu. Kwa sababu kimsingi hao watu hawataishi hawata hawatasimama kuleta vitu vyao kwetu. Never. Hawatasimama. Lakini na, na wao na hiyo sio shida. Yaani watafanya tu. Yaani yeah. ukisema kwamba watu wana to exploit hawatasimama. Mm. Hawatataka kuendelea kuwa kutajirika kufanya nini. Hawatasimama. Lakini je, sisi It doesn't matter how I mean what matters is how you react. Mm. Yaani ina, inategemeana sana na vile jinsi tunavyo react. Mm. Sasa kama sisi ni watu ambao tunajua tamaduni zetu, tunajua ni nini tunakihitaji, tunajua ni kipi sahihi kwetu, mm. mm. haijalishi wewe ni nani, unasema nini lakini sio zote tutashikilia kile ambacho tunakifahamu kwamba hichi ni kwetu, kwetu ni sahihi. Mm. Mm. Hichi ndicho ambacho tunaungamana nacho, hichi ndicho ambacho hakiwezi. Kwa hiyo haijalishi utaleta nini. Lakini itakuja na tutasema kwamba no this is not right for us we're not gonna take it. Mm. Kwa hiyo ni kweli tunachosema kwamba ufahamu wetu kama wa Afrika au kama wa Tanzania bado una ukoloni. Kuna mtu jana alinipigia simu. Mm. Akasema akasema hivi akasema Mika mimi nataka niame nchi. Okay. Nataka yeah nataka alisema nataka niame nchi. Sita sema jina. Yeah. Sema nataka niame nchi. Samani kama unaangalia. <laughs> so nataka niame nchi niende nchi nyingine niende mm. Marekani niamie Marekani. Mm. Yaani mimi nikisikiaga hivyo moyo wangu unaumia mm. mara moja yani unaumia kabisa hata po mwenye uliniambia moyo unaumia kabisa <laughs> kilago aze to korea na 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 sorry entire aze entire aze najua nikusoma sikiria sikia najua nikusoma yeah my brother <laughs> niache nimaliza kwanza point yangu umeona <laughs> moyo wangu uliumia sasa nikamuuliza ila sikutaka kumjaji kwa nini nikasema kwa nini unataka uende kwa sababu sema nataka ni apply green card nataka niende marekani nikasema kwa nini unataka uende ndio swali langu lilikuwa la kwanza kama hujui kwa nini usiende. Kwa nini uende? Kwa sababu alikuwa anataka ushauri wangu, akaniambia sababu. Aliponiambia sababu, anikasema that's cool. Yeah, you can go for that. You can go. You you do your stuff and at the end of the day you come back. Kwa sababu najua kwamba kuna kuna watu ambao wanaondoka Afrika yeah. wakitafuta maisha bora nchi nyingine, wakizania kwamba kuna maisha bora kule. Kumbe in reality maisha bora hapo huko. Wa Marekani wengi sasa hivi wanahamia Afrika. Wengi sana wanahamia huko sababu wanataka ule ubora wa huku wanataka kwanza Afrika kuna hela kuna kila kitu nataka kutafuta huku sasa hamna haja wewe kuhama nchini kwako kwa au barani mwako kutafuta maisha sehemu nyingine huku barani mwako unaweza kutengeneza maisha wewe na vizazi vyako na uka, na uka survive ukaishi vyema na vizuri oh na na i see you have something you want to say <laughs> <laughs> kila gazo by, by, by the way uniambie kwa sababu uko nataka kwenda kusoma kwa hiyo 
Kwa hiyo nitakwambia nenda nenda. Sasa mwenye nimefanya hivi. Thank you. Thank you for that. Yeah. Uh, kuna kitu ambacho ngo nataka niongezee. Okay. Kwa lile swali ambalo kwa umeuliza kwamba tuko 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 free. Mm. Ni kweli Afrika tuko in the tuna uhuru wetu. Yeah. Kiwalisia ni kwamba hatuna. Yaani hiyo hamna haja kwamba twende mbele au nyuma. Zamani ulisema Kwa nasema hivyo. <coughs> kulingana na ambacho nataka nikisema kwa yeah. kulingana na ambacho nataka nikisema uh-huh. sasa hivi. Zamani ulisema polisi waje watukamate. Nasema <laughs> yani wazee wetu wamepigania uhuru. <laughs> eh hey, alafu wao nasema hatuna uhuru. Bo, oh, mimi sitaki matatizo. Aisha <laughs> utasema tutasema tulipata uhuru kulingana na tulichokuwa tunakipigania. Kwa sababu by that time okay, watu wal, walikuja kutukontrol wakiwa hapa hapa nyumbani mm. wakiwa na bunduki zao lakini mm. tukaanza kutafuta sasa uhuru mm. wa kuwaondoa wao na bunduki zao mm. na tulifanikiwa waliondoka. Mm. Lakini after there wakaja na system nyingine ambayo mm. mpaka sasa hivi ndo inayonifanya kusema kwamba hatuko huru. Ndio. Kulingana yes. na kila system ambayo tuliopo sasa hivi kielim mm. system yetu Mm. hatuko huru mm. kiuchumi hatuko huru kisiasa hata kijamii mm. which ambao hata hivi vitu ambao tuna hiki ambacho tunakizungumzia sasa yeah. hivi ni kulingana na kwamba hatuko huru tungekuwa tuko huru kulingana na na, na siasa zetu au huru my bro ni kwa ni kwa nasema Hulu Hulu TV anajua kuna Hulu TV. Unajua that, that, that's another problem. Yeah, Kwa sababu so unasikia mmoja mm. kati unasikia hiyo hiyo ndio tatizo nyingine <laughs> ambalo napaswa kifa ulifahamu yeah. kwamba tungekuwa tuko Hulu <laughs> usinge alisema hilo swala. Kwa sababu si tunafahamu jamani we have been affected with mother tongue. So you you have to respect that. <laughs> Sawa Hulu mimi kana wanza Hulu Hulu TV yeah sawa kuna Hulu TV yani kama Netflix eh yeah, tupo Hulu okay tupo, fine ah, let, po, let, let, let me say my point okay, najua sa, mnanielewa sawa i don't like that mimi nikosi kuelewa eh jamani mlimuelewa po mimi hapa nikosi simuelewi okay basi endelea jamani mimi 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 ni 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 ya ni mtu fulani hivi ambaye nimetokea interior ya huko Kiswahili ni imekuja kuwa lugha yangu ya pili ya tatu <laughs> Sawa kila kesa. Yeah. Thank you so much. Mm-hmm. Don't do that again. Okay. Kwa tungekuwa huru kwenye mm-hmm. tungekuwa huru kwenye 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 system zetu za za kisiasa labda mm-hmm. kama ni tamaduni zetu. Hatuwezi tukajiaddress kwamba tuko huru wakati hatuko free kwenye kwenye kwenye, kwenye hiyo mantiki. Umeona? Kabisa. Yeah. Unajua yeah, unachosema ni sahihi na nadhani hiyo ni topic ya another time. Nadhani itabidi tuje na episode ambayo tunazungumza kuhusu Uh, ah yeah, je, tupo huru au tupo huru? <laughs> tu, Tuende deep. Kwa katika hilo. Eh, lakini mimi nataka tu turudi back kwenye kwenye system ambayo tulikuwa tunazungumza na Tanzania na na na, na wefa Joe right here. Um na na you guys also please andika comment zan yeah, down there mtuambie unafikiria. Sure. Welcome to Swahili Nation. Thank you so much. Yeah. Ah, right here.